Manila has explored the caverns extensively. She's never ventured through this small tunnel. But I had to. It smells like After a tight squeeze, the passageway continued to curl around. I am creeping through about 150 feet below the streets of Naples. It's amazing. It was dark, cramped, and quiet. This thing just goes everywhere. Amazing. Oh, how cool is this? This is like a little mini cistern or something. The water would have been coming just surging through here. And above here, they had the footholds for these guys to do their work. So they were climbing all through here just like we are now. And then it just goes on and on and on. <sighs> yeah. It's getting a little cooler up here, a little chillier. We're going a little deeper, I think. There is no end in sight. Here we go. An even smaller little opening. Oh my God. What the hell is this? This is still an opening that you can get through if you really work at it. This is a highly seismic area. There are earthquakes all the time in this region. Mount Vesuvius is still active. I am really hoping that there is no earthquake now. 150 feet above me, the city of Naples went about its normal business. Shoppers, commuters, even tourists were all unaware I was deep beneath their feet in a seemingly endless maze of tunnels. Uh, another tunnel down that way. All right, here we go. Oh, here we are. Dead end. End of the excavation. What they would have dug out in World War II. Let's see if we can find our way out of here. 